Hi everyone, I'm Jason from As One Guidance, and this is Eclipse Edition video. Um, so you might be, you know, through these energies that are happening through this, the moon and the sun aligning, um, it's causing a great deal of energy, um, more so than than normal. And what this is doing, or what you might what you might be feeling, is uh, either a lot of upheaval coming up, you know, uh, you know, a lot of things that you've healed have are are being released, um, and you might feel, you know, a good amount of upheaval, uh, maybe th you know, leading even leading up to this eclipse, and and right through it, um, it could, you know, surpass it by a day or two. You know, everybody's a little bit different. However, uh, also what this what this could be bringing out is is a lot of your upsets and and a lot of blocks be being drawn to the surface so that you can heal them. And if you notice, um, you know, any kind of negative emotion in your heart that is. You know that is an upheaval that that is you know that you that's really causing an upset or it's or it's causing a block to something uh, that's you know in order to manifest your twin. Um, these are being drawn out to the surface uh, so that you can heal. So that's this is this is a great thing and it's and that's why um, it's happening now. Like this is this is a, a very divine thing that's happening this solar eclipse um, and and we can you know we touched on manifesting a little bit in the last video and so what, what I want to do is dive into that a little bit deeper today is uh, because of these energies and because a lot of people may be feeling a lot of these upsets coming up and not knowing where they're coming from and and thinking that everything was uh, you know, perfectly grand on their journey, and everything's going amazingly for them. You know, this these energies are 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 bringing out those upsets, bringing out those things that you know have been buried uh, and maybe really hidden away that that you may not have have seen or have, may not have been able to really um, you know get a grasp on. As you go through throughout this journey, so what happens when you try and manifest something? So, for instance, you know you're trying to manifest your twin flame, and you know basically, uh, I used um, in my last video. I think I used an example of roller skates. So we can we can use that same example, uh, you know, to give. A little bit of a broader sense on what it what it really means to uh, manifest your twin. So when you you call in that you call in that manifestation, you call in that desire in your heart that you know I want to be with my true love. I want I, I want to live my perfect life and want to you know me and my twin are gonna live out our life purpose uh, you know for all of eternity and that would be immediately manifested if you didn't have any blocks to it you know i that's what i desire so when you think about you know something small that you might want uh you know i, I want a note i want a notebook you know that's something very easy to manifest i mean not many people <laughs> i'm not going to say that so <laughs> generally speaking you wouldn't necessarily have uh, a block to obtaining a notebook. However, you know, that may not be the case for everybody. Now, that's something that, oh, I want this, and um, it's fairly small, it's a fairly small thing, so I should be able to get that. Uh, there's nothing in my mind that's telling me that I can't have that, or I, I can't... Um, 
that can't come into my experience or, you know, I, I don't feel that in my reality. So, you know, within a very short amount of time, I could manifest a notebook. Uh, or, like, you know, as the example I used last, last video, uh, have, having a pair of roller skates. So these are general... These are general things, but you can you can test, you know, the divine. You can test the universe and say, you know, I want to see uh, a red truck drive by, and like the universe will provide that for you, you know, pending that you don't have a block to having one of these things. Having, you know, these things are uh, generally small, and there's nothing that's keeping you from them. However. When you try and manifest your twin flame, they're, especially if you have been with them before, been with them in a relationship prior to this, and you know there was a separation phase, um, there's a lot of hurt, and there is uh, a considerable amount of you know pain and, and anguish and, and a lot of things that go with being you know, ripped apart, basically. Um, and all these things just need to be healed, and, you, and and the separation just needs to be healed. So, I want my twin flame, right? That's, that's my desire. That's what the, the desire is in my heart. So, you go along, and you're feeling great, and, and then all of a sudden, your mind throws these things at you, like, uh, you're not good enough. You know, that's, that's a block. Heal that block. Uh, and then you feel great again. And then I don't deserve this. You know, I don't, I don't deserve this love, this, this phenomenal amount of love. I, I just don't deserve it. You know, that's a block. So you heal that. And all along the way, your job is to feel really good, feel that inside of yourself, feel that deep in your heart know that this is uh, a guaranteed thing that you know that you're being provided for your with your true love because that's what you asked for that's what you called in and you're not you're you're not separate from uh, from God and you're not separate from him providing you the things that you desire so the more and more you clear what's blocking you so you understand that you are if you're one if you and your twin are one and you share the exact same energy and this is this is a great day to talk about this because with this solar eclipse uh, if you're on this journey you feel something today you know even if you're really really numbed out uh, you're if you're really like you know just pushing down those any feelings and you just and you you think you feel great but you you know you're not really looking inside yourself even if you're really like that even if you're really numbed out you're still going to feel something on a day like today with with all with the uh, amount of energy that is being uh, you know really shed on everybody so that's where you know that's the the path that is laid out before you in terms of uh, how to get into union, how to be with your twin. It's just every step of the way, you know, feeling that feeling that peace and feeling that joy inside of you, and when something comes up, heal that block, and then. You know, continue and continue, continue until you know you manifest you manifest union. There's no more blocks. You know, you're 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 that one energy. All it is is a belief that you are separate from from them. All it is is that belief that you know they're choosing separate from you. They're they're physically separated from you. And that's not the case. When you heal that, when you heal that misaligned belief, boom! Manifestation, manifest into union. 
you're already you are are already in union. You just have to rip, you know, rip the what whatever's blinding you to that fact. So use this use this eclipse. Use the energy that's being given to you. Use use what's being shown to you. Uh, these blocks that that are coming up or these upsets that are coming up. And you know if if it's uh, not blocks and upsets, and if you're if you're upheaving a lot, then you know just uh, really nurture yourself through that and and allow that to uh, release or allow the those those upsets to release out of you. That's you're you're expanding your love by this by this happening. You're, you can feel your heart expanding uh, as you draw in more and more love, and you're you're going to the next level of this journey. So that's a great thing. And, um, you know, visit asoneguidance.com. Uh, I can help you along your journey uh, through, uh, you know, any coaching sessions or email coaching sessions. And, um, you know, leave a comment down below. And I will see you next time. Everybody enjoy your eclipse. Take care.